Small streamer leaks his income from Twitch ad revenue. Did you, Fugazi? Yeah, bro. Ads don't make money. I shouldn't run them. Oh, wait. Ads are like, ads are like floaties, bro. <laughs> They're keeping me up, bro. <laughs> that ass. He, he, something he must be um he must be botting or he's doing he's doing something he's doing something here to hack this 100 percent. something is wrong here people are saying he runs ads every four minutes for what for three minutes <clears throat> He ran 4,080 minutes of ads and 16,230 minutes of streaming, averaging 956 viewers. One minute of ads every four minutes of watching. 15. That would mean, um, when it says one minute of ad every four minutes of watching, that means in five minutes he's run one minute of ads, right? Or does it mean in four minutes he's run one minute of ads? Or I can just look at this, I guess. It would be one minute of ads and then three minutes of watching. What would his um what would his fill rate and CPM have to be? Like even if he was running this many ads. There's no shot. Have any other big streamers talked about this? There's just no way that this is the case. This can't be, even if he was running ads that much, there's just no way that he would be getting, um, there's just no, there's no way. If you, let's say you're running six minutes of ads, every 30 minutes you do a three minute ad break. I don't know if they still have these buttons. So you're doing six minutes of ads for 50, um, for 54 minutes of content. Um, He's doing in 60 minutes of content. He's doing 25% are ads. So in 60 minutes of content, he's doing 15 minutes of ad breaks. Right? Whereas an ordinary streamer might be doing three to six. So he should be making five to 2.5 times what an ordinary streamer would make, five to 2.5 times. So let's imagine he's making five times as much so an ordinary streamer running three minutes of ads, um, let's assume they're making one fifth even. Um, 20,000 a fifth would be 4,000 in ads. Well, could he be? Would you make $4,000 in ad revenue a month with 1,000 concurrent viewers streaming less than 300 hours? One, I'm not even sure if you could do that, but maybe you could. Maybe you could. Number one, maybe you could. But the second issue would be there is no shot that you are serving all of these ads that people are watching them. There's just no way because nobody's going to sit and watch a stream where every three minutes you're getting a minute of ads. I don't believe that. They have to be ad blocking or they have to be – um or you, do you get paid ads for trying to serve ads to a subscriber? I'm gonna make a random guess, having absolutely no idea what's going on. I'm gonna make a random guess. What if, what if, this, there's no way this is true. There's no way this is true. But what if Twitch pays you based on when you run the commercial button, Twitch looks at the viewers you have, like the, the geographic region, because that's where, the, where they're filling, and then they pay you for running the ad button. But then what if there's a separate system or a separate module that determines if an ad is actually served 
and you can actually exhaust serving ads to people, but you could keep pushing the commercial button. And even though it's exhausted on the ad serving part, you're still making money when you push the button because the calculation is different from the actual ad injection or ad delivery, maybe. That would be a really goofy way. Well, that system might solve a few problems relating to reliable revenue for streamers or for um, or for other issues relating to ad fill, maybe it would like, but it would just, you'd lose money on that because streamers would be, I wonder if that could be the case then. So like, he's like, so he's just smashing the commercial button and he's still getting money for it every time he pushes the button, but the viewers aren't actually seeing ads because the, um, because the ad, the, the inventory just isn't there or there's a cooldown or something. So he's found a way to cheat the system. Maybe that would be my guess. But I, but I with absolutely no background understanding, I would not, I'm not sure that because this is just not possible. There's no way that you're making this much ad revenue off of only a thousand concurrent viewers streaming um, 270 hours a month. I can't believe that. No shot. Is this per month? Yeah. Simpler explanation. It was a publicity stunt. Um, Yeah, and then this too, last pay period, he got $27,000? No shot. Are ads served to Americans worth more than other viewers? Yes, America is generally, I think, the most profitable region to serve advertisers to. What is this cash? Okay, don't care. No way Twitch doesn't catch someone doing that if they're making five times other stream. Well, it's, it might just be a small enough amount of money that um, they don't care in the grand scheme of things, maybe. But How often are those numbers relevant you think it would be? If somebody had a 1,000 concurrent viewers and were running ads, it's been a long time since I've seen like what ads pay out on Twitch. But my guess would be anywhere from 1 to 5K a month if you're running a decent number of ads with 1,000 concur concurrent viewers. That'd be my guess. It would be one to five K a month, maybe. Oh, I could reach out to other streamer friends and see how much they got on ad revenue. Are there any Twitch contract rules about showing income on stream like this? Not generally, I don't think. But I haven't seen any of the new contracts, so. So during um, like drop events, that maybe could be the case. But I feel like somebody would have brought that up if that was the case. Where you have, um, like if there's like, a, if he's playing some game, because they did this for Apex, right? Where you can like watch streamers or Rust to get drops and streamers can get like 30,000 viewers or something, maybe. I don't know. I appreciate that, Destiny. All right, bye. Remember to hit that like and subscribe, and don't forget the notification bell so that my videos show up right in your feed.